Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Uncover the seamless process of connecting a domain to your GoDaddy website. This comprehensive guide provides step-by-step -step instructions on the main linking, then a settings and troubleshooting common connection issues. So guys, without further talking, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So, guys, for this specific video, we are going to talk about connecting any other domain that we don't have in our GoDaddy website or that we have in our GoDaddy website to our uh, like GoDaddy free website that they are actually giving us for free. So, the first thing when you try to publish a site, they will ask you the three questions or the three options. The, they will give you like basically main three options to either publish it on one of your existing domain names that you own or get a new domain or free go to the URL it is completely up to you to choose so now in that case in case you had a domain on GoDaddy already or you don't know how to get a GoDaddy domain let me show you real quick simply you just have to go ahead and open GoDaddy open this section write the name that you want for example Titan LTD opens the space you will it will open for you then search whatever just look for whatever domain name you want and check the price if it fits you just get it so now guys as you will be able to see for example i want this titan hd.site so simply i'm just going to click here and then looks good keep going and there we go so here make sure to remove this no domain protection and remove this one and go to continue to cart as you would see here the pricing will be as it was showing to us uh, at the beginning so here it is now we just have to remove other stuff for example this one and now we have this one perfectly good to go we just have to refresh this and the price is 0.99 as you can see so we are still in the safe zone now we only have to pay it with either paypal or your credit card so you just have to choose one of these options that are in here and then you will be very good to go there is nothing that will be missing in your subscription now this is for this part for the second part of this video is basically you will find this domain uh, in your account so you simply have to click here products and you will find it right in this page so normally if you didn't create a, a website yet you simply have to click on manage and you will find all of your details or your stuff here so simply as you can see in this menu the website option will be uh, open for you in my case i don't have it because i have already used it and i have already a website using this domain name so simply by clicking on this logo they will take me to my website on this uh, like specific domain name that i have chosen now this is for the first thing now let's say that we want to transfer like uh, domain from another host or from another platform to GoDaddy because you can't really connect your website with a domain name that is outside of GoDaddy so what should we do in that case we'll simply just have to go to your account settings go to your product and here you will find as I said your product so here I want for example to manage all so click on manage all and here we'll find every single domain so in case in case you would like to add a new domain in here well you will have to do these three things firstly open the domain name official website so in my case I have it on Hostinger simply I will just type here and here I will just type my password and normally it should be opened for me in a couple of seconds so this is for the first step so let me just check the password once more all right I have forgot about it but it doesn't matter it's gonna be fixed in a couple of seconds but yeah this is the first thing to do and open good idea as well then you have to go to godaddy.com so godaddy.com and here you will find domains so let's click on domains and here as you can see there is this section which says transfer domain names so simply here you just have to get your domain to be written here for example i want to search for me like that 
and now let's just wait for it until they show us like the domain name so this domain is already registered to GoDaddy if it is yours you can transfer it to another GoDaddy account you will need you will be asked to sign in first make sure to sign in to the account that the domain mineralville.com is associated with so this is for uh, this uh, like this domain let's try to search for another here we go and now we are good to go so now we are on here on this page where we can simply either buy this domain or transfer it so in case this domain wasn't like like uh, in here so for me this domain is kind of new but i bought it already i have it on my hosting for some reason it's showing like i don't have it so let me just try like any other domains let's press that com let me just go here and go back twice i guess here go back once more okay like that and check if it is available in GoDaddy or not. Yeah, so has pressed as you can see. Uh, go to your current register and get your uh, unlocked domain. So a domain lock prevents it from being transferred. It may called register lock, registration lock, transfer lock, domain lock, or lock. So simply all you need to do is to go to your own hosting, get the code, and paste it right over here. After you do so, the domain will not be locked as it was and you can now start transferring it from the other platform to your GoDaddy account and then simply all you need to do is the same thing click on publish change my domain from this one to another search for any other domain that you have so you can use a different domain so as you can see here minerva.com and in case it was available so whenever is registered with GoDaddy we can't connect to this domain and now all you need to do is click to transfer it now or no change domain in case you would like to change for another domain let's try for example uh, espress.com here we go second domains so now as you can see you simply have to go to the DNS of your domain so here we go let me just go here and add the DNS that they give me to my domain name so just copy the add and this value and the ttl and the same thing goes for this one and paste them inside of my domain and just like that after a couple minutes my dns records will be updated and my domain will be linked to my own website and from there on i can simply start using the, my new domain name that i have chosen and connected to the website as my main one and official link and start sharing it with my friends family and my viewers to check on my news and my blog in general so yeah guys that was it for today's tutorial if you enjoyed it make sure to leave a like and subscribe and if there is any more questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section i will try to answer all of your questions one by one so thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial